Any investment in biomedical research is going to improve human health and advance discovery, but we determined that investing early in a scientist's career was going to yield the largest dividends uh, for us at Pew. I think that the Pew Scholars really had a major role in my career because I received this fairly early on. Having a specific mechanism that funds young, young investigators is really important. The Pew Scholars is really unique in that it both uh, gives the, the confidence to be able to pursue new areas as well as to bring together a cohort of people that they can really interact with and, uh, and learn from along the way. Yeah, how did that work out? As we announce the 26th class of scholars, they're joining quite a family of biomedical scholars who've gone before them. I'm stunned when I think back about the success of all of these young men and women. They've gone on to become Nobel laureates, MacArthur Fellows, members of the National Academy of Sciences. The Pew Biomedical Scholars Program was launched over 26 years ago to encourage innovation and inform risk-taking in young biomedical scientists. We knew that this insurance policy for risk-taking was going to be at its core, and by that I mean providing four years of unrestricted support to these young scientists. We just wanted to understand how chromosomes work. There wasn't any clear disease implication at the time, but we knew that working on something really fundamental would have implications later on, and that's one of the really exciting things about doing science is you answer a particular question, and then it opens up many more questions, and you have a choice of which avenue to go. And so having the funding and the freedom to do that allowed me to then follow those different directions and, and learn entirely new things. America has distinguished itself in the biomedical sciences. It's been a gift to the world. We need to continue to make the investment in innovation and in science that has made this country strong and improved lives around the world.